Willkommen zurück zu einer neuen Folge Red Dead Redemption 2. Und ja, wir müssen das Telegramm jetzt abholen. <lacht> Was da angekommen ist. Mal gucken von wem. Was es beinhaltet. Und ja. So, Bote. Was hast du Schönes für mich? Wieso guckt er mich nicht an? Excuse me, Mister. I'm Jim Milton. Heard you had a telegram for me? Yes. Here. Sign there. Thank you. Huh? Jim, stop. If you're the JM I know, stop. It's Sadie Adler. I've got something to discuss. Pay good. Meet me in saloon in Valentine. I'm there most days. Stop. Sadie Adler. I'll be damned. Alles klar. Die Vergangenheit holt uns ein. Woher weiß sie, dass wir hier wohnen? Das ist die erste Frage, die wir uns stellen sollten. Wer hat uns gesehen? Abigail! Da liegt ein Brief auf dem Tisch. Ist sie abgehauen mit dem Sohn? Ja, anscheinend. Darling John, a kind lady in the village helped me write this. She had many problems of her own, but that's a different story. Listen, I have begged you, but it don't seem to make much difference. I've tried everything I know to make you grow up. And you know I love you, but loving you means I can't watch you do this. Time after time, we've had to run because of your behavior and your decisions. We got a son. I got a son. And I love our son enough that I can't have him around while you're like this. I had so many dreams, John. I hoped you would change. We all saw what happened to them that didn't, but you... Part of you is hellbent on ending up the same way. And I love you too much to watch that no more. Abigail. Where's the wife, Milton? Uh, she's out. I saw her leaving with the boy and the bags. What's going on? You married Mr. Dickens? No. That don't surprise me. What'd she do? Catch you with a showgirl? Or hear about you shooting more fellas over by Strawberry? Just who are you, Jim Milton? I'm a family man. I can handle a gun, sure. Them men shot at me. Just interested, that's all. Ain't nothing interesting. Unless you find gossip about a man's marriage worthy of your time. Guess not. There's work to be done. Unless you're running off too. I ain't going nowhere. I'm here to work. Gotta save money, get her what she wants. What does she want? She wants a place of her own. Said she found a plot up at Beecher's Hope. You? A rancher? You'll starve. Probably. <laughs> Keep yourself busy. Take your mind off it. Kehre zur Arbeit zurück. Das machen wir. Wir müssen uns dann aber noch mit Sadie Adler treffen. Aber erstmal steht hier Arbeit an. Äh, unser Pferd können wir gerade nicht rufen. Wieso auch immer. Nö, das will nicht kommen. So, einmal den Zaun reparieren. Ich glaube, den haben wir selber auch kaputt gemacht.
wenige Monate später. That's her fool. Hey, you know I was wrong about you. Turned into a fine worker, Jim Milton. Oh, thank you. Means a lot. Hey, you think I could speak with Mr. Geddes? See if maybe he's open to offer me some guidance? No, I'm sure he'd be happy to hear you speak at least. Thank you, Mr. Dickens. Gut. Geht es. Gedris Haus. Einmal hin. Mr. Gedge. Hey, son. How's that bull? Fine, Mr. Milton. Is your father in? Can I have a word? Sure. I'll just get him. Pow! Yeah, I'm right, right here. <sighs> What's the problem, Milton? Sorry for the disturbance, sir. Oh, no problem. My wife, she just began her morning discourse on the subject of my faults. An experience I think every man can relate to. In some ways, my wife... My wife also has issues with some of the decisions I've made. Real issues. Hmm? Do you believe a man can change, sir? Where is this heading? I guess I don't know. <clears throat> I've tried to be a good hand. I've worked hard to secure your property. And for that, we are grateful. And you've paid me well besides. The thing is, I suppose, I need to get a place of my own so I can prove to my wife that I've changed. I understand. But I ain't got much money. And I ain't asking to borrow none. But maybe you could go to the bank and put in a good word so they could give me a loan. A loan, huh? So I can buy that place, Beecher's Hope? Yes, I know it. Yes, of course, sure. It'd be, it'd be my pleasure. But take my advice, Milton. Take your money and go buy passage on a boat. Go to Brazil and forget all about family. I'm just joking, son. Just make sure you deal with Ansel Atherton at the bank. He's a distant cousin. Use my name. Tell him to ask me direct himself. You'll get what you need. Thank you, sir. Yeah, I was young and dumb once, too. <laughs> You'll get her back. Good. John Marson is wieder back. Hoffentlich. So, einmal kurz Stopp. Wohin müssen wir denn jetzt? Blackwater Reiten wir auf jeden Fall erstmal hier hin zur Bank. Dein Bart wächst nicht weiter, wenn du keine Haar benutzt. Oh mein Gott. Oh mein Gott. Steh doch auf, Pferd. Also echt. So, warte mal. Wir reiten wieder hier auf dem ganz normalen Weg. Ich habe keinen Bock, dauernd gegen Bäume zu reiten. Es geht mir nämlich derbe auf den Sack. Ich 
been living too fast and I've been living too wrong. Cruel, cruel world, I'm gone. Und weißt du was? Wisst ihr was? Wir treffen uns jetzt erst hier mit ihr. Der Weg ist einfach kürzer. Deswegen. Wir treffen uns jetzt erst mal mit Sadie, Abigail. Und mal gucken, was sie für uns hat. Informationen über Dutch wäre natürlich gut. Das wäre vielleicht. Ich weiß gar nicht, was das war. War das vielleicht ein Bär? Hat sich auf jeden Fall so angehört. Wie ein Bär. Ach, da kommen wir nicht rum. Wir müssen die Straße nehmen. Dauert zwar ein bisschen länger, aber es ist dann halt so. Fährt ist nicht das Schnellste. Hat auch noch sehr wenig Ausdauer. Das können wir nicht so knüppeln. Warte mal. Ich glaube, wir nehmen die Eisenbahnbrücke. Ja, wir nehmen auf jeden Fall die Eisenbahnbrücke. Nein, 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 nicht runterfallen, nicht runterfallen. Geh rauf. Es geht ein Weg nach unten. Den nehmen wir denn. So. Weißt du was? Ich, ich werde jetzt Kreuz querfeld einrennen. Reiten. Jawohl, hat sich auf jeden Fall genommen. So, Valentine. So, wir wollen uns mit Sadie Adler treffen. Alive. 
Jim Milton, that you? Guess I didn't do a real good job of hiding my identity. <laughs> we didn't hear nothing about you. You, you killed a feller up by Roanoke? Sure did. I thought that sounded like you and Abigail and Jack. She? She's fine. <laughs> she was always so kind to me. I'm looking to buy us a property. Beecher's Hope, west of Blackwater. I'm kind of a farmer now. <laughs> and you? Oh, you know how it is. Bounties mostly and some other stuff. Good and bad. Are you any interest in bounties? No, uh, I've gone straight. Huh? Sort of. Oh, well, it's legal. I uh, usually. Then, maybe. Come on then. What? Where are we headed? Strawberry. Got on the run from New York. Good price for him. What'd he do? Rob a bank. With a gun? No, nope. with a pan. He's an accountant, I think. Okay. Sounds easy. Hello. Come on. We got a bit of a ride. I know. Strawberry. Da kommen wir doch gerade her. You said you had something to discuss. I didn't think we'd be chasing down an outlaw. There's something else. What? Maka. Maka? I think so. I heard of someone sounded like him uh, about a year back. Okay. We always said if we found him. I know what we said we'd do. That ain't changed. I didn't think I'd see any of you again after you left for the Yukon. Now we came back. Didn't strike it rich, as you can see. But you're a rancher now. I aim to be. Probably why I can't afford it. <laughs> this country's becoming real civilized. Bad folk won't be around for long. Wo gehe ich lang? Hier? Befahre Leute in der Stadt nach Nelson Kirk. Say, I mean to meet my friend in town, but I don't know where he's staying. Bald New Yorker, Nathan Kirk. You know where he is? Great, I don't know. Leider nicht. Er weiß also nichts. Okay. Fangen wir ihn mal. You see that? You seen a bald New Yorker, name of Nathan Kirk, about 45? No, sir. If we get plenty of New Yorkers here. It's resort town, you see. The Adirondacks of the West, the mayor calls it. But <laughs> I can't remember any of the bastards. Okay. Ask in the general store or the post office. They tend to know who's in residence for the season, as we say. Season? Good lord. Im Season? Also hier oder wie? Hey, I've, I've been a real fool and forgot to ask my friend Nathan Kirk where he's staying. You got any idea? He's a bald feller from New York. I'm sorry, I don't know. Hm. Okay, im Salon sollte ich es mal probieren. Wo ist denn der Salon? Ist der hier? Ja, ne? You, uh, you seen a fella? A fella from New York? Bald guy? Yeah. A few New Yorkers come here in search of the West. This one's a wanted man. I work for the government. 
sort of. His name's Nathan Kirk. Mr. Kirk? But he's so charming. Is he staying here? He's, uh, up in room three. I'm gonna go pay him a visit. It's government business. How exciting. There you are. He's staying in the Wellington Center. What now? Zimmer three. Eins, zwei, warte mal, hier stand irgendwas mit untersuchen. Mr. Kirk! Mr. Kirk, you in there? Who is it? It's just a friend. Stop! Hey! That's Nathan Kirk! Gut, komm. Baby girl. Aus dem Weg. Hey, wo ist sie denn hin? Ich jetzt hier die ganze Arbeit alleine machen. Gut, wir haben ihn, Mr. Kirk. Thanks for that, Mr. Kirk. Real fun. I'm an innocent man, but it's all a mistake. My wife, my wife is a is a desperate woman. How are you buried, sir? None of your business what I am. She made me do it. She broke. What? Where shall I send the money? I ain't been paid yet. Hold on to it for me. Need to speak to the bank over in Blackwater. Get a loan for the property. Might make them happy to see I've got a boss. No, so I've got a couple of other leads I could use your help with if you're interested. I'm usually at the saloon in Blackwater. I need money pretty bad, so I'll come find you. Gut, ja, wir müssen jetzt zur Bank reiten. Das oh, mache ich aber auf Scream ohne euch. So, wir sehen uns. Wir sehen uns dann in der nächsten Folge. Dann bin ich schon bei der Bank. Bis zum nächsten Mal. Lasst gerne eine Bewertung da und ciao.